not particularly quick. That's not really going to test fellas of this calibre. Kimeli and Krop may be playing into the hands of Kip Limo here, or they are both surely pretty fresh if they're running some 30 seconds or so inside the tempo of their run in Rome. There's a wall of Kenyans now, a small wall of Kenyans in front of Kip Limo, but I fear, I think he's going to bide his time. He's going to leave it until the home straight. Surely he won't expect to come wide. He's going with Krop now around the outside. Look at that, hanging onto his coattails. Stride for stride. The Kenyan's kicking hard. He's the world record all over the half marathon. Does he have the speed to go with these two? Kimeli and Krop flailing arms now. And here comes Kalim Kiblimo, like a machine, like a metronome, easing past them. But is he going to get there? At the line, he is. It's the double for Uganda again. Kiblimo makes it a win of the 10,000 and a win in the 5,000. And the Kenyans were outthought and outraced. Mark Scott, his rally comes home for a fabulous fourth place, some way back. But my word, what a race that was up front. Rayner coming home as well. Up in the top eight. Kiplimo's time, 13.08. After a strange, strange race. The time at 3,000, remember, 8.01. That was outside 13.20 tempo. A super fast.